One of the most dangerous things a Christian can say to another one is, mind your own business. I've had somebody literally tell me being a good Christian means to mind your own business. Usually Christians that say this don't want to take accountability for anything. But in order to operate and function properly as a body, we have to be on one accord and we have to hold each other accountable and we have to call things out. Even when we call things out in the world, why wouldn't you want to save your brother or sister from the fire? I've seen many people use the analogy as, oh, if you see somebody crossing the street and they're about to get hit by a car, wouldn't you shout out like, hey, you're about to get hit by a car to save that person's life? When I first came to Christ, I was scared to tell people certain things that um, would be uncomfortable for them or even uncomfortable for me because I'm not a confrontational person. The more I started to grow and hear from the Lord, he would take me to Ezekiel 3, 18. If anybody has ever read Ezekiel, you know what I'm talking about. The Lord literally would tell me if I do not warn or give the words that he told me to give to his people, then the blood would be on my hands. And the Lord is not a man that he shall lie. So when he would tell me these things, I'd be like, okay, Lord. And I would tell the person whatever it is that the Lord was telling me to tell them because my fear is to the Lord. My loyalty is to the Lord. And I want to make him happy. But yet now we have this modern day Christianity where if you mind your own business, that's being a good Christian. Or, you know, you worry about yourself or work out your own salvation with fear and trembling, which is taken out of context. Then that makes you a good Christian. You worry about you and I'm going to worry about me. But that is wrong. That is deception. And it's not helping anyone. We need to be there for one another. We need to be holding each other accountable. We need to be reproving and rebuking in love. Everything that we should be doing to one another should be for edification. Even when you're out there evangelizing to people and bringing people into Christ, it should all be done with love. There is an order in the way that things should be done. And a lot of people are not upholding that order. And that's why there's so much chaos in the body. Now, the Bible also says, you know, if people don't accept you and they don't want to accept the word, they don't want to hear the word, you're supposed to keep it moving. Don't try to shove it down people's throats because then they say you're forcing it. And in that case, you really are. If people don't want to hear the word or they don't care about Jesus and, you know, getting right with the Lord, keep it moving and go to the next. But we have to get out of this. Oh, mind your own business as a Christian. Because if you're calling yourself a Christian, your business is my business. And the Holy Spirit reveals all to his people. Amen. So get out of that mindset. Love you guys.